Hey there, welcome back to Comic Talk. I'm Matt Kane. Today I'm talking about Doctor Strange issue 18. If you want to catch up on the previous issues in this run, go ahead and click the link to be directed to the last issue. In the meantime, a quick recap. Strange's manservant and close friend Wong has been possessed by Mr. Misery, the embodiment of all of Strange's pain and suffering. Misery decided to attack Strange's former patients, giving them massive brain tumors. Seeing how this problem was too big for him alone, Strange calls on the mighty Thor for help. The issue starts off with the God of Thunder and the Sorcerer Supreme finding Misery outside the hospital, causing, well, misery. Misery take, makes his escape while Thor and Strange have bigger concerns, namely all the brain tumor patients that popped up. Strange states that they have to get to work and he'll be assisting Thor as he confirms he knows her identity as Dr. Jane Foster. He explains that he sees through magic spells, including the one that makes her Thor, but it doesn't matter, what matters is saving people. The two get to work on operating on patients, and after a moment and plenty of Strange's backseat operating, they are able to get the tumor. The tumor attacks Thor, but Strange quickly grabs it and eats it, explaining how it's his own pain and it's only natural to bring it back. Suddenly, the patients begin to seize and Thor has no choice but to operate on all of them at once. Luckily, she's the god of thunder, which means she is able to move like lightning. Misery clearly does not like this as he appears and proceeds to attack the doctor. Meanwhile, Thor has finished taking out all the tumors and is about to close up the patients when all of the growths combine and attack her as well. The two heroes are saved when Thor summons her mystical mallet, Mjolnir, and uses her lightning to knock out Misery. After the patients are healed and we see Strange back at his Sanctum Sanctorum talking to Zelda explaining how he plans to exercise Wong and should something go wrong he wants her to shoot him and blow up the house. In the end we walk in on Wong slash Mr. Misery as the exorcism is about to begin. So there we go, that was the issue. The issue was uh, definitely a little more lackluster than the previous issue, I feel like we had Thor appear simply because Jason Aaron, the writer of this comic, also writes the Mighty Thor series as well. I mean, Thor using super speed to operate on all the patients was just a little too much. I mean, Thors are always able to pull some random power out of their ass, but super operating, come on. I'm enjoying Misery as a villain. I, I mean, just think about it. The negative side to using magic, that all your pain can evolve into a sentient creature, is a really cool concept. As for the next issue, I'm definitely going to keep an eye out and do a comic talk when it comes out, so be on the lookout for that. Once again, I'm Matt K. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.